Welcome, to ViewChem, the Chemistry Animations Channel. E Z Isomerism Isomerism Compounds, having same molecular formula, but, different properties, are called as, isomers. This phenomenon is, isomerism. Isomerism, is basically of, two types. Structural isomerism, and, stereoisomerism. Further, structural isomerism, is mainly of, three types. There are, chain isomerism, position isomerism, and, functional group isomerism. Stereoisomerism, is basically of, two types. Geometrical isomerism, and, optical isomerism. In this animation video, geometrical isomerism is explained. Geometrical isomerism. Compounds, having same molecular formula, but, difference in the position of the, same atoms, or, groups of atoms, onto the, both the sides of the, double bond, are called, geometrical isomers. Geometrical isomerism can be observed, in the compounds, that contain, X double bond Y group. Both, X, and, Y, can be, carbon. Or, X can be carbon, and, Y can be nitrogen. Or, both, X, and, Y can be nitrogen. In a compound, having double bond, between the two carbon atoms, if same atoms, or, groups of atoms, are on the, same side of the, double bond, that isomer, is a, cis isomer, while, atoms, or, groups of atoms, are on the, opposite sides of the, double bond, Then, it is a, trans isomer. The necessary conditions, to exhibit, cis, trans isomerism are. The molecule should have, C double bond C, and. There should be, only, two, same atoms, or, groups of atoms, each of it, should be bonded to, one sp2 carbon. Examples, cis, 1, 2, dichloro, ethene, Trans, 1, 2, dichloro, ethene. Cis, but, 2, ene. Trans, but, 2, ene. Easy configuration. If, 3, or, 4 substituents, that are bonded to, 2 sp2 carbons, are different, then, we cannot use, cis, trans, notation. For such type of compounds, E, and, Z, convention, will be followed. E means, and gay gun, atoms, or, groups of the atoms, of the higher priority will be, on the opposite sides, of the double bond. Z means, Susaman, atoms, or, groups of the atoms, of the higher priority, will be on the, same side, of the double bond. To assign, priorities to, atoms, or, groups of atoms, rules of, Kahn, Ingold, and, Prelog system, should be followed. Rule 1, based on the atomic numbers, assign the priorities, 1, and, 2, to the two atoms, or, groups of atoms, that are directly bonded to, each of the, sp2 carbons. The atom, with more atomic number, gets the, higher priority, while, the atom, with lesser atomic number, will have the, lower priority. Example 1, let us prioritize, the atoms, that are bonded to, sp2 carbons, in, 1 bromo, 2 chloro, 1 fluoro, 2 iodo, ethene, atomic number of, fluorine is 9, chlorine is 17, bromine is 35, and, Iodine is 53. Now, based on the atomic numbers, let us prioritize, the atoms, that are bonded to, 
each sp2 carbon, in, molecule 1. On the first carbon, bromine gets, higher priority, while, fluorine gets, lower priority. On the second carbon, iodine gets higher priority, while, fluorine gets, lower priority. As, the higher priority groups, are onto the same side, of the double bond, it is a, Z isomer. In the molecule 2, we can observe, the higher priority groups, onto the opposite sides, of the double bond. So, it is, E isomer. Note, if two atoms, of the same element, are, directly bond to the, sp2 carbon, then, atomic numbers, of both the atoms being same, heavier isotope gets, priority, over, the lighter isotope. That is, if protium, deuterium, and, tritium, directly bond to, sp2 carbon, then, the order of the priorities are, tritium, greater than deuterium, greater than protium. Rule 2, if, two atoms, which are directly bonded to, sp2 carbon, are same, then, priorities are to be assigned, based on the atomic numbers, of the adjacent atoms, till, the first point of difference, is attained. Example, 2. 2 bromo, 3 methyl, pent, 2 ene. Let us assign, priorities, to the, atoms, or, group of atoms, that are bonded to, second carbon, in, molecule 1. Atomic number of, carbon is 6, and, that of, bromine is, 35. So, bromine gets, higher priority, while, methyl group, gets, lower priority. But, the atoms, that are directly bonded to, third carbon, are same. Both are, carbon atoms, and, the atomic number is, 6. Now, we have to apply, rule 2, to, assign, priorities to, methyl, and, ethyl groups. Rule 2, says that, when, the atomic numbers of, the two atoms, that are directly bonded to, sp2 carbon, are same, then, the atomic numbers of, adjacent atoms, should be considered, till, the first point of difference, is reached. By closely observing the above structure, the first point of difference can be observed, at the immediate next positions, to the directly bonded carbon atoms. As the atomic number of carbon is, more than hydrogen, ethyl group gets priority, over, methyl group. Therefore, the priorities, of the groups of atoms, that are bonded to, third carbon, in, 2 bromo, 3 methyl, pent, 2 ene, are, Ethyl group, gets, higher priority, over, methyl group. As the, higher priority groups, are on the, opposite sides, of the double bond, it is, E isomer. Rule 3, if, the atom, that is bonded to, sp2 carbon, is doubly, or, triply bonded, to other atom, then, that atom is, considered as, duplicated, or, triplicated. Example, 3, 2 methyl, 3 chloro, prop, 2 N, 1, Al, the molecule, can be written as. Let us assign, the priorities, to the groups of atoms, attached to, second carbon. In both the groups, carbon atoms are, directly bonded to, sp2 carbon. As the, atomic number of, both the atoms, that are bonded to, sp2 carbon is same, that is 6, further, in the aldehyde functional group, as the carbon is, doubly bonded to, oxygen, we have apply, rule 2, and, rule 3, to prioritize, methyl, and, aldehyde groups. So, according to rule 3, aldehyde group, should be considered as,
Aldehyde group should be considered as. That is, it should be understood that the carbonyl carbon is bonded to two oxygen atoms and, in turn, carbonyl oxygen is bonded to two carbon atoms. Rule 2 says that when the atomic numbers of the two atoms that are directly bonded to sp2 carbon are same then the atomic numbers of adjacent atoms should be considered till the first point of difference is reached by closely observing the above structure the first point of difference can be observed at the immediate next positions to the directly bonded carbon atoms. So, aldehyde group gets first priority, while methyl group gets second priority. Now, we have to assign priorities to the atoms bonded to third carbon. As the atomic number of chlorine, 17, is more than that of hydrogen, 1, chlorine gets the higher priority. As the high priority groups are on the opposite sides of the double bond, it is E isomer. If one of the sp2 carbons is bonded to cyano group, cyano group should be considered as it should be understood that in cyano group the carbon atom that is directly bonded to sp2 carbon is supposed to be bonded to three nitrogen atoms and in turn nitrogen atom is bonded to three carbon atoms similarly ethanyl group should be considered in the following manner carboxylic acid group should be considered as in this manner by assigning the priorities to the atoms or groups of atoms bonded to sp2 carbons e or z notation can be assigned thanks for watching please like share and subscribe